My name is Dan Sheshe Matakaya. Love attacked me with sulfuric acid and electrocuted me. I met my ex-wife in my line of duty, whereby uh, I went to to her grandmother's home. So they had a case, and I was I had been minated that case to investigate, and we became friends, and then the friendship elevated to now dating then we we got married things changed for the worse when now oh, my child was sick my child was admitted to Kerokoya district hospital uh, diagnosed with uh, meningitis and severe pneumonia uh, but we lost the kid i feel the loss of my child changed her uh, to a certain point eh? because uh, I, I realized that the happiness that was in her face had disappeared. My ex-wife was such a quiet person. So whenever we are having any sort of conflict, she used to keep quiet. So at that point, she kept quiet. Then I made a decision. I called her mom. I told her, this is what is happening here. Just call her and then ask her what is the biggest issue, what is the issue. Then her mom called her and told her to, to, to go home. So I just went to the bed to sleep. And a few minutes later, as I was sleeping, that's when she woke up and poured sulfuric acid on my face. And then she ran away. When she poured uh, the acid on my face, it was so bad because it was burning. When I, I got out of the bed to try and get some water to reduce the burning sensation, I stepped on the floor, I felt a shock. She had gone further and connected electricity, whereby she had taken the water heater that we used to kuchemusha maji and connected to the power and then kayaja the floor. Then on the floor, she had poured water. So it was like a pool of water. So when I stepped on the, on the, on the, on the floor, I felt a shock. And at that point, I was even more confused. I never made any step or any move. Because I was suffering, I was in pain, I just screamed uh, for help. For 15 minutes, I can say I was in a different world because at uh, that point I was confused, totally confused. I'm burning, I don't know what to do. It was so tough for me. I thought that I'm dying. The pain uh, was so severe and I was trying to kujishika, how the body reacts uh, to that pain. You try to kushika uone kama itapungua, but now ilikuwa inaendelea. 